Hello everyone, today we are playing Fish and Superstar X, now available on Steam and uh, maybe other places, I don't know. Check it out, from Turbo Pelvis. Full disclosure, they uh, gifted me this game. I am given a few games, you know, every so often by developers to uh, kind of check out myself and maybe review or feature on the channel, and I've gotten bad about that, so I thought to myself, it's time to actually do bit of a let's play on one of these games. So we're starting with Fish and Superstar X. Bit of a roguelite type uh, third person space shooter. And um, let's just get into it. I don't think we need the whole backstory. This guy made... I guess we'll spread our DNA points around. There's our alien pilot. Pilot clones. And then we can also clone science officer, an engineer, or medical officer, or we can just upgrade our guns. I think I'll stick with that. We can recruit more folks as we get into the field, but for now, let's stick with that. Um, so in addition to, obviously, having benefits, you know, shields and armors and fixing the ship and things like that, you get additional turrets. So it's a bit also like, um, uh, it's going to come back, it's going to come to me in a second. The, uh... The, the, the love game. <laughs> it's got love in the title, I think. But anyway, that game where everybody controls a different turret. In this case, it's just me controlling the turret. Let's do a little backstory here. Today we're launching the most glorious mission. A bomber from Planet X will be carrying a weapon of incredible power. I see as I slip into the voice. Her name is Celine Fishin. You will let her land on your world, and she'll perform for your amusement. You will enjoy it. I guess. No, I'm not insane. This is not radiation sickness speaking. It probably is. Let's be honest. You better enjoy her and have some concert stages ready. <laughs> or else she'll detonate. That sounds like a threat. I would shoot it down before it got into the uh, solar system. I assume they have the technology to do that in these worlds. Just in case you forget we were playing, this is Fish and Superstar X. <laughs> Good branding there, just to remind everybody. Alright. There that goes. And now we're free to fly about I'm using the Logitech F310 here. Controller, so we got our energy, which is the gun up there. I'm not sure why the science. Ooh. Or the science icon has an icon next to it, or the science field, where we have our officer there, but I don't know. So we uh, shoot things and we get cash, which we can spend to upgrade our ship, upgrade our crew members, get more crew members, things like that. Um, you see we took a little bit of damage there, as I pointed out with the top gun. Um, if you tune in for a couple of the live streams, or at least... Uh, one of the live streams, I think we did this. Jamie and I did this game. Um, so there is a video technically that of, uh, of us playing this before, but it's behind the Patreon paywall, so you could, uh, you know, give like a dollar a month or something to see that. All those videos. Check it out. Patreon.com slash Let's Play With Brigands. So many advertisements in this video, I'm realizing. The Let's Play With Brigands Patreon, the Logitech F310, this game. But anyway... Hopefully you're not too offended. Um, all right, so deep, spa uh, deep space recruitment, progress one or two. I'm not really sure the difference. Maybe that means like how much more difficult it's going to get. In any event, we have 720 space dollars. Let's try to recruit some more people. So, 10% <laughs> off. Oh, this is rough, man. I want that Captain Dancing Bear so bad, but it would totally defeat the purpose of our pilot clone that we already got. Why do they gotta make the best? And look, he's got, you know, decent stats too. So, let's go with the, um, let's go Android. He's got good aim, good armor, and he's a, a medic professional. All right, so we got him. We can't afford anybody else now, unfortunately. These guys are having a good time, by the way. Look at that. Honey Brown, drinking that. Everyone's having a great little time. And we can save and quit and come back to it. That's good. All right. So now we have two guns, top and front. So as long as ships don't go where these guys came from, we'll be fine. <laughs> All right. We need to get an engineer after the next one, I realize. I think he's the one who can fix the ship. 
because you'll see it did not fix itself between rounds. Is there any overlap? There's no overlap. Some, some of these ships look like juicers or something. Like literally, like fruit juicer. So no, nothing too crazy here on the... Oh, that would be my shield button there. Nothing too crazy on the first couple waves. Nothing Celine can't handle. Oh, I keep thinking I don't have that other gun. I can shoot in the front now. Thanks, medic. Let's have like a side. Okay, what do we got here? So we can improve one. We can heal the crew. Repair the ship. The crew seems to be okay. So let's just upgrade the pilot. And we have enough money, it looks like, for another recruitment if we want. Deep space, deep space, shipyard, weapon shop. Um, I don't know. More, more people on the ship seems good. Hey, what's going on? Alright. So, I want an engineer or a science officer. Bikini bar. <laughs> They're buck teeth. Sluggo! Wow, he is a better pilot, but... And then a cute little bear. For the uh, named Ash. All right, let's go with She Arg, who looks like she's confused by her headwear. She Arg. All right. Three of the four guns are now operational, and we can repair the ship, which we will make it a point to do, since that thing is smoking. And we can shoot behind us now. The only place we are vulnerable, as you can see, is directly beneath us, which. Okay, so we got this guy. Why is this not breaking? Is he not trying to mess on us? He might be okay. He might be a good guy. I got a chainsaw on his... Okay, then. <laughs> I guess all the ships just have a vulnerable spot for the most part. Like this guy just flying. Very exposed in the front cockpit there. I have a side goal of getting completely straight line on some of these sites every now and then with no uh, no breaks I feel like I see it every now and then but I could be could be losing my mind good thing these other ships are lemons compared to Celine all right look tiny little so there's as I look up the progress bar it's like two notches would take us a little bit further obviously is the crew okay their bars all seem to be full, so I'm going to assume we're okay. Let's repair the ship, see, see what this looks like. Okay. That's cool. Fleet massing, deep space, space cows recruitment. I'm curious, let's go with that. Oh, it's just named the bar, I guess. <laughs> okay, can we get Senor Gonzalez? No, we cannot, so I can replace somebody if we need to. And honestly, we're getting to the point where I'm like, I'm, I thought that maybe our, uh, what's this? What's getting fixed here? Did they need health, I guess? I don't know. Didn't seem like they did. Um, I didn't see anything change on that. Um, I was just going to say the stats aren't going in that up that fast for our pilot, so maybe we will want to. I don't know. Do we want to? Okay. Yeah, they're hurting us. <laughs> Good lord, then we got these little rogue guys out flying. Alright, so remind me not to come to cow space next time. Adorable as they are. They look very angry, actually. We don't have a gun down there, don't be a dick. Oh, he's being a dick. Ow! Oosh. Taking some damage here. Uh oh. Guy's got a gun in just the right spot. We need more energy for our gun. This is rough. Alright, we are on fire in the back. Alright, that could not have come at a better time. Alright. Oh, and the pilot is very hurt there, I see. But I think the, uh, the ship comes first, right? 
All right. Let's um. So it's a longer mission. I see. So it's deep space, and then recruitment in between. I guess is the idea. So I'm not sure if I'm ready for a two-minute mission. So maybe let's go to the weapon shop. Interesting. Uh, so we can get some of those things that we saw other people using. The chainsaw, as an example. And it lets us put it where we have a slot. Is this a better gun? Alright, so the front, or the top gun, is the leveled up one that we got in the beginning. So... A rifle. Is that better? I don't want to do a space chainsaw. These are all the same price because it's all the same thing. Oh, I can't afford that. Okay. <clears throat> Least potent ammo-based space weapon. Hmm. So maybe that was a waste. Whatever, we can save our cash for a round. That's not a big deal. It's probably smart, actually. Oh my god. I would be just like fly into these when we get fixed and stuff. Oh, someone got uh, their health back. Whoa, my god. Okay. <laughs> I figured that guy was dangerous, but I didn't see the whole entirety drop that much. All right. Made it four stops. Hmm. Destroyed foes 16. We destroyed more than that many ships. All right. So there's no carryover, so it's a little different from the uh, roguelites that I'm thinking of. But that's fine. Um, I don't know. Do we want... Uh, go with the engineer to fix the ship up. Just gotta make it a point not to explode ourselves on one ship. <laughs> it breaks off, and there we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we are floating in outer space. Maybe I can't get it completely straight. Alright, so we have our wussy little gun on the top now, unfortunately. And I'm noticing a difference already. So that does make... Does make a considerable difference. That's pretty close. Oh, one. One tiny little knot in that one that time. It's also how it like snaps into place, too. It's not like a fluid 360 or 90 degrees, I guess, in that case. All right, I do have the shot behind me. Can't forget. You're smoking in that quadrant. All right, so we also need to make a... Or I need to make it a point to recognize where the guns on these ships are coming from. Like the chainsaw or the, uh, the ship that has the flamethrower in the front. All right, so let's fix the ship. Train, the train skill goes up so slow. But it is everybody's skill, I guess, is the idea. Anyway, um, recruitment. 650. Burning a hole in my pants. So we can get Skulator or Dr. Freelon. He's got great aim, the doctor. So maybe when the captain has a great skill level, and you choose to level up everyone's skill. It shows you how much it would cost to fix them. Man, that is not relative there. I mean, look at that. 70 for... Clearly, it looks like double the damage that she's taken versus his 65. That's weird. All right, let's go with the... Uh, I don't know. Go with the doctor. Do that. All right. Exciting. His guns on the front. Both these guys' guns are on the front. It's probably 
designated names for all these ships. Oh, that was close. Nearly had it again. Thanks, guys. Does this guy just ram me? Is that his thing? I'm gonna learn to prioritize the guys that have their ships are massive. Uh, oh, I just shot their pilot. That worked out pretty well. I guess that's sort of a one-hit kill. Obviously. Hopefully not the same for our case. If our pilot goes down, we might be screwed. I don't know. Maybe you just can't even turn in that case. <laughs> You're just at the mercy of where everybody shoots and uh, is oriented around your ship. It's interesting. Alright, so... Let's just make... So everyone's skill will go up. Yeah. Okay. Um, so there's no recruitment on this one. Let's just, let's just do this. We just save our money. Just go into the, straight into the next round. It's not possible to completely straight line. He's going to shoot from the back. I feel like if we get close enough. Oh, God. Put that saw down. Or rather, leave it up because it wasn't a danger to me right there. They're not, not giving me time to straighten out my... There we go. A beam. Alright. Does that hurt me when their the carcasses of their ships hit me? Okay, I don't like that. Yeah, just aim for the pilot, it sounds like. So I can see where that aim comes in handy. As we learn about this game, figure out how to play it. Do I see a little guy down there? I do see a little guy down there. Definitely aim for these pilots. Alright, that was a minute. Earn your salt. Proceed to intercept. Um, let's fix the ship. Didn't go up that much. Because our engineer's so crappy, obviously. Alright, uh, let's go to the comet tail. Maybe we can get a better... Ah, look at Poplowski. They're great. All right. Oh, look. He's got an attitude. Tude. It's like Sonic flicking us off or tails, maybe better said. All right, we got a full crew for the first time in this game. Watch somebody die now. All right, good work, team. Got to aim for the pilots. I feel like conditions are more difficult here. It's kind of slightly more difficult to steer. Maybe it's just my imagination. Oh god. It's got a little crane or something. Ah, flamethrower. Why is everyone a dick? I'm noticing. So if I hit that, oh, I get the cash. It's not just getting cash when I destroy a ship, it's like, you want to grab everything. That's good to know. I was missing that. Sorry if you guys caught on to that, like in the first, very first uh, mission I did. How long is this mission? Was this two minutes? Oh god, stay below me. Not you. You can stay behind me. As far as I'm concerned. Give me your stuff! I want all your stuff! Alright, so that was cash. One of those was energy. So while it does replenish on its own, I think we want all that crap. It goes up a lot faster. See, so yeah, I remember when I was like, man, I wonder if it hurts me when I fly into a ship's debris. Yeah. So I got ammo. I haven't even thought about ammo yet. That's a good point. <laughs> Keep an eye on. There we go. Look at that. We've never had so much money now that I know how it works. <sighs> Prove crew's maximum HP. That's kind of cool. But I think we need to fix the ship. So now I'm just constantly wondering about who we can uh, improve upon. We gotta check out the shipyard at some point, too. Tandalumics. <laughs> 
Raw turkey knot. That's adorable, and you're better than our engineer. But not by much, but we'll take you. <sighs> we also need to be probably better about conserving our money at some point. Whoa! Is that... Is this a boss? Or is this just some crazy dude? I feel like we want to go for his eyeballs, but I don't know. Oh my god, that's disgusting. King Vomit. Is he going to give me stuff? Yeah, maybe. Well, that was interesting. Not sure what that was about. So it's that... It's it's crossing. Oh. Or it's walking that tightrope of, like, not wanting to get too close to their guns, but at the same time wanting to be near them when they explode to get that sweet, sweet space cash. I got no cash from that because I didn't I wasn't around where I needed to be. Uh-oh. Little guy, who do I prioritize? Probably the big ship. Nice if I could like disarm them. Aim for their guns. Boom, give me all your stuff. So, yeah, the yellow is the gold, the space cash. And the green is the ammo. Coming up on something here. Oh, this guy's got guns everywhere, almost. In the same fair. He might have armor there. Still learning to spot different things. Get out of here, guy. Come back when you have a ship. Oh, wait dead. Can I just <laughs> run into some of these guys? A thousand space dollars. Cool. <sighs> See ya. Yeah, just upgrade all the special crew shop. That sounds cool. Fancy. Oh, boost skill. Oh, it's expensive. You can only go here when you have the space cash, I guess. So I feel like we want to upgrade. I wonder how much it's going to go up, though, is the thing. Is that how much it's going to go up? Versus this? Like, that's going up the entire way. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> okay. Do you need fixing, too? Little turkey knot? Raw turkey knot. Okay. Oh, God. Keep that saw away from me. I feel like the saw is... The more dangerous concern gives me all that stuff. Wish I could just grab his saw by flying into the wreckage. I don't know about those waves. Sound waves, that's probably dangerous. Oh, who's getting that space gash then? Oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa, I don't like that your front tire looks like a buzz saw. I learned the hard way that saws are dangerous. So we really want everyone to explode in front. No! Oh my god, no. That guy just destroyed me last time. Alright. We want to keep everyone in front of us if possible. <sighs> okay. So his skill's all the way up. So if. Let's see what this does to the ship. Boom, look at that. Helps having a competent engineer on the ship, huh? We don't really have any money. So it's just, so we could also go backwards, which is not probably what we want to do. And it shows us, I see up there on the top, where it's gonna put us. Let's go, um, Comet Tail. A two minute mission. Maybe we want to go to the shipyard, actually. We haven't been to the shipyard yet. A one minute mission. And this will improve just the basic stuff. Yeah, that makes sense. Can't afford any of it. There you go. All right. As we continue on, oh, the scientists and the engineer took some damage. It's all about space cash, so let's try to put as many ships in front of us as possible. Right, they're about to go. Let's go 
Takes cash. Not bad. Much on that. Oh, space cash. There you go. I went right for the uh, cockpit there. The problem is, when you go for the cockpit, a lot of times the shot is behind you. So you're not going to get the sweet, sweet resources. So is that doing anything? His. That's good to know. His little wake doesn't really do anything to me. Oh, and I got some health from that too. There we go. All right, that worked out pretty well. Crew armor, that's probably important. Did everyone get healed? Oh, I did pick up that thing, that's what it was. I thought it was for the ship, but it might have been for the crew. It might have been for everybody. Okay, um, crew, crew armor. I like that. A three minute mission, that seems dangerous. And this is plus three just for one. You probably also, that's the trade off, don't want to go too far ahead. Unless you're well, uh, well equipped. Anything good here? A better doctor, but that's about it. Freelon's done a, done right by me. Gogglestone. Never know who you'll see. It's never the best uh, environment to recruit somebody when they're getting tanked. Don't like your ship guy. I do like all your space cash that comes out of it though. He has a bit of a shield, I guess, going on there, right? Yeah. I have a shield too now. Forget about that. Put the shield up sometimes. Does the shield take more uh Yeah, that takes energy. We gotta watch out for that. So energy is more important than ever. Like it, they're basically neutered when they all their guns are behind me. Didn't get much from that though, unfortunately. All right, how we looking? Everybody's looking good. In which case, let's go crew armor. Pluto. Experience breach. Pluto. The Junker boss's tank is on the move. Ooh, Kuiper Junker's home planet. Whoa! Let's only bring out that shield when we need it. Whew. Shield does its job, though. Not sure where I need to be hitting here. Thing. Ooh! Shield is... It could be wider. That's the thing. Oh, there we go. That's probably where we want to shoot. Some of bitch's eyeballs. All right, so I'm gonna assume we can't do much of anything. Oh god, our engineer! Turkey knot. Oh good, came back out. <sighs> Need energy. Move. Not good enough with the shield. There we go. I blocked some of it there. Move. All right. Just cleared that there. All right. Going for the eyeballs, and it worked. Any space cash? Oh, a lot of space cash. Space victory from space. <laughs> Big new dude. And there's Celine, and they're doing the show, I guess. I don't know. All right. Um, crew armor or ship? I guess the ship needs repairs. Yeah, that didn't even get it all the way. So we're gonna hang out here longer and run destroy planet and unlock ship. Oh, we get a new ship, is that what's going on? Uh I don't know, we could spend a little more time down here, I guess. We have a ton of money, let's go to the shipyard. Pair the rest for nine dollars, that seems like a good exchange there. Alright, um better handling, sure. Better armor, definitely. Ship energy points, we could have more energy. 
or better shield? Would that be the shield that I use with my science officer? Let's just go armor. And also, shield. It's all about defense. Defense wins championships, and I assume also space uh, games like this. That's just a shield. I don't know what I'm worried about there. Give me all your space cash. It's gonna blow! There we go. Oh, we did take some damage there. During the expo- Oh, I'm hitting those things. That's what it is. Jeez. I did not even... Yeah, they did say... That we were... Oh, I don't want that. Oh, God. Get behind this guy. Oh, my God. The medic is almost gone. Alright, this is... This is dicey. Was this a one or two minute mission? Feeling like a two. Okay, now we're all right. Heal the crew, my God. <laughs> um, where should we go at this point? Oh, so it's, I thought it would give me a chance to, we'd still be on the planet and I could do one of those things. That's weird. Where am I right now? I'm, uh, that's where I am. All right, um, 980, let's check out the weapon shop. And get us, there's that wave gun. Shields are mostly ineffective at blocking it. Dish that sends energy waves at short distance. So when they're right up on me. So who's generally right up on me? What direction are they coming from? Maybe ships beneath me. Maybe that's a good move there. I'm hesitant to replace the top gun because that seems to get the most work. Yeah, let's go down there. A machine gun. I couldn't afford that regardless. Uh, more ammo. Yeah, why not? I don't know. It's probably not a big deal. All right. Can you heal anybody while you're... I guess not right now. Damn. Oh, we're not looking good. Oh my god. We just straight up lost our medic. Because I'm still hitting things. I'm not seeing. Alright then. Game over from Spakes. So this game's hard. <laughs> we'll give it one last go now that I think I understand 90% of what's going on. About the space cache and prioritizing things and crap like that. So, let's do that. I killed like four times more foes, that's good. Alright. Actually, I'm pretty good at aim, not to toot my own horn, but... Boom. Alright. Um... None of these guys are that good is the thing. From the start. I'd rather just recruit them. I'll just take a better gun where we need it most. Oh, is this new? No. This was not available last time. Level length limiter. Prediction is very difficult, especially. Ah, oh, so this is cranking up the difficulty. Wow, I can't handle what we're on right now. That's crazy. Alright, hopefully we'll at least get back to Pluto this time and I can just do the bomb. Maybe the bomb is just like, you know, it's just like, forget it, screw it. We're not doing anything else, we're just going back to, I don't know. It's just the skip, whatever, stop that you would make normally. But we'll see. We'll try it next time, assuming we get there. Oh right, I don't have a gun at the bottom now. Son of a bitch. I can just bounce off. That doesn't seem to do anything. You're not know, just push him out of the way. <laughs> Poor guy. No. There's my timer at the bottom. I didn't notice that before. Sorry if you did. I'm sure you did. <laughs> I was not paying attention. I'm just pushing this guy down out of the way. 
I like that that doesn't do any damage, though. And he's just like, Dick? No science officer. Alright, guy. Your gun would be in the one place that I can't go. Alright, so that's it. Gotcha. And nothing else to do there. And recruitment. Let's do it. And who we got? Anybody good? Aw. Lewis Pollitt. I'm thinking uh, it wouldn't be bad to have a better pilot. The skill seems to be very important as the pilot, as it improves everybody's. And I'm not that impressed by anybody else. I know it's crazy not to get a second. Oh, now we gotta look at that, though, is the thing. That's the trade-off. Gotta look at that. That is... One tough ship. What the hell is going on with that? Take all that. I just like bouncing these guys? Nah. They can't shoot behind them though, right? Nah. Oh, I guess they could shoot down. Where's your your guns at the back? Get underneath me. Good lord. But wait, I want your space cash! Yeah, round's almost over. I'm starting to look at that clock now. Now that I know it's there. Boom. All right, we definitely need more folks. Recruitment. Dr. Ware. His skill's low, though. I'm looking at that skill. That is clutch. Leg locks isn't bad. Let's go leg lock. Rot Roboter. Mm, what do we got here? Oh, the little guy. Oh, he's behind me. Okay. I was like, where's my other gun? Guns aren't in good spots. I was shooting both there for a split second. I bet these things have tons of resources. Oh, that guy got destroyed, I think, by the other ship. Quite possibly. I think the gun on that one took him out. Oh, God. No. I was hit, hitting the science area, which we don't have right now. I don't know if I should waste shots on this, knowing that we can't take it down. Where's the pilot even on this ship? Super low energy. It's a long one, too. Energy? Energy? Yeah, I can't take those things down. Yeah. Even their little... Their engine wash doesn't seem to disagree with my ship. What's that? Oh, we got fixed. Cool. Could use a ton of energy, though. That's for sure. Ah, you can't hit me. We need like a chainsaw or something to saw through some of these other ships. Oh, I want the canister. Damn it. All right. All right. Uh, gotta repair the ship. Didn't get that much cash, quite honestly. And none of these are looking that good. Let's go away from the asteroid field. The best folks are always the. Uh, ones I already have. 
We get Tom. We can just afford Tom with a dot. Space dollar to spare. I think it's a, a sign. We may win the award this year for the space award for ugliest crew. Sorry to say. Shoot in the eye. Oh, his head's turning colors. Although that guy may have had... <laughs> he may have had something to say about the ugliest everything. A little bit of space cash from that. It's like a mini boss. I like when they go down fast like that. It's nice. That was my phone buzzing. Alright. I can never tell where to shoot these things. There's no obvious pilot area. I guess it's in the front. He's all protected, but... Eat that guy. He goes down quick, though. He doesn't have a lot of, a lot of health or shields to that thing. Ah, oh, I thought we had it for a second. Yeah, maybe it's not possible. Really need that front gun. Get away. Out of here. Coming up on Pluto. Ooh, maybe don't hang out right underneath that guy. I want that canister. There we go. Oh, it's energy. That's what that was. Engineers can have his work cut out for him. You can really tell the difference with the, uh, the gun I have for the pilot versus everybody else's. It goes so much faster. Honestly, just having those guns for everybody, I think. I think we need this. And then if I could, uh, oh, I can't recruit anybody. Oh, special cruise shop. Interesting. Hopefully I can afford some of these people. Dr. Decoy. <laughs> I say. Hmm. I'm trying to think. I guess she's not available for recruitment. Such a good science officer in terms of skill. It just says boost aim. Is that for 920? That's oh, just something they give you to improve leg lock. I see. Oh, it's 69 at a time. Can I still afford uh, Dr. Decoy? Yeah. All right, there's our full crew. Coming up on Pluto here. Boom. Get out of here with that. Come on now. You get out of here with that too, actually. I don't think about it. Do you have a gun? Oh, it's on the back. Sometimes you have to look for it. Hidden. Man, I like being right on top of them when they explode because that sounded weird. But uh, you get all of their gold and ammo and energy and crap. It's like shooting the gas tank in GTA, uh, one of the older GTAs. Hence the kill. Oof. Let's just go right for the cockpit. Sure he's okay. Blow up already. Go. Let me get that one. Oh, I guess some of them maybe have weak spots on them too, besides the cockpit. Or maybe that was the cockpit on that guy. I don't know. That certainly was on that guy. But he blew up off screen. That's not cool. All right, picked up a lot from that. Tasty. More space cash there. And we're headed down to the surface. So what? Okay, guy. Alright, guy. Ow. I'm trying to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with you. Alright. 
Um, what do we need? What do we need? This guy's pretty good at healing the crew. Let's go with that. Might need that for our next sortie. Okay. Mmm. Weapon shop? I guess. Before we head down to the surface, because I think that's next. So, can we finally get a chainsaw? Yes, we can. It's a melee weapon that deals fairly high damage. It uses ammo because it's fuel source. It's a stored in the ammunition bag. Um, alright. Where should we put it? Guys who are coming up uh, behind us? Not guys in front of us, that could be good. Eh, let's just try the, uh... Let's do this. Let's do the back. Let's see how this goes. And the rifle's just garbage, I think. And this is just ammo. Grab a little bit of that. Are we headed down to Pluto? Not yet? I need to check the map, actually. I just assumed, because we were... It was right in front of us. Stop it. Oh god. Shield it. Oh, they said that thing doesn't really work against the shield too, didn't they? Alright, yeah, you keep doing your thing. Oh. Ugh. Get out of here. Quit shooting while you're blowing up. Rude. Space rude. It's also a good idea I'm seeing to kind of spread out the kind of ammo that you're using there. Boom. With your different guns. Because obviously this is taking ammo on the chainsaw. But everything else is using energy. I was not paying attention to that. There's still some things that I'm missing out on. Uh, repair the ship. Obviously. And 406 bucks, we don't really have anything. Okay, let's, um... Yeah, let's... Yeah. Let's stay on these easy levels for now, I think, is the, the plan. Just... It's gonna take a bit longer to get where we want to go, but... Oh, you got a chainsaw? I got a chainsaw, too. In a spot that's not stupid. So there's that. Speaking of which. <laughs> oh, man, you're probably more effective when you're behind someone. I oh, like you're right now. Chainsaw on chainsaw! Alright, it's getting a little crowded here, fellas. Smoking. There we go. That worked out. So I do get some cash from the initial everything. And ship. Get that almost back to tip top shape. Space rush hour. That sounds dangerous. Sounds like there's going to be a ton of ships. These are all really long. Let's go with space rush hour. Progress 3. Oh god. <laughs> These are just commuters that we're murdering here. But I'm getting cash for it, so. Oh my god. Freaking space rush hour. There's one of those guys. I don't have a good track record with those guys. Alright, so let's use that saw when we can. In fact, to make it a point, oh my god. Come here! Come here! Yes, everybody get behind me. I am totally okay with that. This is not a bad round considering everything that's going on. Oh my god. We're only halfway through, too. This might not end well. Just saying. <sighs> Some of these guys are boxing me out, too. They know what's going on. They're no dummies. Try to stay away from your 
flame beam. All right, guy, quit moving with me. Jeez. 30 seconds. We are out of energy. All right, guy. Guy, seriously? Let me use my freaking chainsaw. We need to have one more chainsaw. Something that uses ammo. Oh, God. Oh, he does have a gun back there, doesn't he? We should use our... Oh, we're out of energy, so I can't. Oh, my pilot's dead. Yep, this is what I thought might happen. <laughs> you can't move. <laughs> we're just floating. Okay, I don't think we can go to Pluto without a pilot, though, right? And we clearly need to fix the ship. I don't have a pilot. This is going to be stupid. So it does move just very, very slowly. We are screwed. We really are screwed. Oh my god. And we have no we have no gunner in front either. Yep. This is uh <laughs> Well Alright, so it helps to have a pilot. I will, uh, I'll say that. <laughs> That's what I learned from playing, uh, Fish and Superstar X, but that was Fish and Superstar X. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I think this will be a great game, as I now know a lot more about it, to cycle in during live streams every now and then. It's nice for a one-off play, but, uh, thanks again for watching. Thank you to the developers for, uh, letting me play this. And I'll see you next time for more fun, fun times right here on Let's Play with Brigands. Hope to see you then.